In this episode of CNET Conversations, we meet a guy who hitchhiked from Texas to California to get a job at a floppy disk company. Later, he rose to become the CEO of Seagate. Reinvention being the essence of Silicon Valley, his ouster from that job has put Bill Watkins back into startup mode on a mission to light up your life with LEDs. Twenty percent of the American grid of energy is for lighting alone. So you look at that market, how do I how do I make people save money in energy? And how can I do that with intelligent light from control functions for lower energy, light, etc.? And you open up all these possibilities. And that's what Bridge Lux is about. First, it's all about LED lighting, but made a different way. <laughs> what happens here? This is a reactor room. So that's where we have oh, the so nuclear. Nuclear, yeah. This is where we grow our epitaxial films on our wafers near either silicon or sapphire. How can you drive down the cost of LED? Because right now, LED fixtures yeah. for both uh, institutional and consumers yeah. are high. Today, we manufacture LEDs on sapphire-based substrates. This is our two-inch sapphire wafer. So uh, sapphire wafer, these are basically sapphire discs, very yeah, thin. It's very thin. But this is pretty small. But it's small, it's fairly expensive. Then we thought, well, what can we do different? Boom. Now this is classic semiconductor right. business yeah, stuff. This is, this is pureated these are silicon, wafers, yeah. it's your DRAM. And we basically use gases and materials and we, and we build a, a series of layers. What we have solved, is the ability to do that eight inch in that those temperatures and those gases without any cracking or breaking or lattice mismatch. This is where you come in and you go to factories right. that have moved on to a 12 inch, it's right? Which is the new high yield, yeah, right? They used to make DRAM for our USB it's drives right, or whatever right, on this, right, or right, semiconductors. Right. And you say, you guys aren't doing much with those lines. We want. We're we can make we're lights on. Make lights on that light. Making LED lights in a way that echoes making silicon chips doesn't just drive down cost. It also paves the way to embedding intelligence and new functions into that module that lives in a light socket. We don't look at that as a socket, we think of it as a node. When you start putting a light into chips and making them intelligent light, now you have an ability to do applications here. Why not turn your lights off from your iPhone? It's going to be a light that eventually will react to your environment, your, your motion. Eventually we can see lights that can look at the room, that will, will measure what's going on in the room and adjust the light to optimal reading conditions or optimal TV watching conditions. Watkins departed Seagate after a dramatic falling out with their board, one that led to a new beginning that seems to suit him. After Seagate, I thought, you know what, I want to go back to real work. I, I'm tired of lawyers and bankers. I want to go back and this opportunity came up to look at this company and I came down here and looked at it. And uh, as, as hokey as this may sound, I came here and I met these young engineers. You know, and they're you know, 28 years old, I probably don't think they're young. But I kind of fell in love with them. It's been a long time since I've been around a bunch of people who think they're changing the world. And so I said, you know what, I don't need the entourage or the jets and stuff like that. Um, this is what I want to do. And that's what I'm doing. Not now I want to go back to the underwater the jets. Right, right, right. Yeah. So I'm gonna get yeah. this as big as I can so I can give myself a jet. <laughs> Great motivation. Yeah, that's right. As is the idea that Bridge Lux engineers could turn the lighting business on its head. The brand names that we've known for such a long time are gonna change. And I think every light eventually in 10 or 15 years will be LED based. The opportunities are phenomenal, not only in the technology, but in the product and in the whole business model. I mean, that's what makes such an exciting industry. It's gonna change dramatically. Now, you may have noticed that a thread of cost saving winds through all that Bridge Lux is attempting. And that approach is going to be essential, as most of their customers, large or small, are used to thinking of lighting as just a cost to be managed, rather than an opportunity to do more with all that infrastructure that lies over our heads. 